a pervasive distrust and suspiciousness of others such that their motives are interpreted as malevolent yes that is what paranoid personality disorder and dr jins matthew today i am going to present paranoid personality disorder a person with a paranoid personality disorder is very very emotionally sensitive to the setbacks and uh, uh, the negative comments of others they always keep it in within themselves they are very sensitive to all these kind of things people of this uh, disorder they never forgive others about the insults that they receive from others and the emotional hurts that they suffer because of others and they keep all these grudges within themselves they never want to forgive and whenever there is time they will try to retaliate all those people they have a suspicious and perversive tendency to misinterpret others neutral behaviors as something that is uh, you know insulting them uh hurting them uh, you know uh, damaging their business their personality or their career all these kinds they have elevated sense of their personal rights in a, in a, in comparison to the rights that of others uh, they don't care about others rights they are more concerned about their personal rights they have recurrent suspiciousness regarding the fidelity of uh, uh, their life partner and uh, many times they get in conflict with them because if they need not to be the uh, the legally married uh, life partner even in the law affairs they have always a sense that you know my partner is called, is cheating me uh, he she or he has got some other affairs so always they try to check the whatsapp uh, and uh, all of the messages without their knowing and uh, they always you know keep themselves awake at night checking how many times their partner is coming to uh, you know online and uh, they will ask at uh, uh, 12:30 in night whom you were uh, talking with or whom you were chatting with all this kind initially the partner sometimes they ask do you really doubt my genuineness no it is not that but i happened to so that's why i just asked they will totally deny it but later the partner will come to know that this person seriously doubts seriously is uh, you know not happy with the, uh, the the genuinity that they show and that will further create problems but later in marriage life even uh, in the extent we can see sometimes these people you know they will uh, say that i am just going out for a week or for you know, a couple of days i'll come back and they will go out and uh, evening they will come back and hide in a bush or in a tree hiding and to to know whether somebody else is coming inside to meet his wife or meet his uh, husband or whatever uh, and the second thing is that you know when the partner is going out for a job uh, they will uh, you know disguise themselves and go behind to see who all the partner meets and who more he talks with where all he spends or she spends time with and sometimes they may not get anything wrong but they will uh, say to themselves maybe it is because of uh, this particular day he might knew that uh, i was uh, coming behind him and he is uh, making game let me do it in another way okay let me do it in another day too and this kind of uh, excuses they will uh make always and uh, to the extent sometimes when the life partner comes back home they will remove the undergarments and check whether there is any stains or anything and out on the basis of that they will make again problems at home people with this particular disorder they have a uh, exaggerated uh, sense of self importance uh, they don't give any importance to other selves but they give uh, importance to uh, one self i am the most important person okay that kind of sense that they have and the other thing is that they always have got some conspirational ideas in their talk and people are talking about me people are talking about me because i am great i am doing some scientific work uh, work of things and uh, people want to know that they are trying to spy on me and this kind of issues and you know uh sometime a week back i saw few uh, people talking in a uh, city and while i was moving one among them 
who was looking at me very weird and that time itself i got an idea there is something going to happen and all of a sudden in my business there was a huge loss it is because of the conspiracy and this kind of weird kind of without any proper logic they talk about it. that is the nature of a paranoid personality disorder thank you very much for watching this video if you like the video please press the like button subscribe button if you would like to continue videos of which i am uploading of this type we'll see you next time with another video bye bye